at 6.30. A visit to Camden shows that the shore is not the only place in New Jersey for an ocean experience. The Adventure Aquarium is marking World Oceans Week with exhibits and activities highlighting marine ecology and conservation. Science and technology correspondent Patrick Regan reports. Close encounters with marine life remind visitors what an alien world lies offshore and under the waves. But it's really the connectedness and interdependence of sea and land that Adventure Aquarium is stressing, according to biologist Michael Grassman, beginning with what's for dinner. People need to think about where they're getting their seafood and should really start considering if, uh, if it's safe for, the, for them because of pollution levels and if it's also safe for the marine environment. Uh, is the fish that they're eating, is it uh, being sustained at good levels, is it being overfished? Aquarium educators outline the links between fish populations and reefs, whether natural or artificial, and explain the many ways human activities touch reef-building corals. There are a number of problems affecting coral reefs right now. Uh, there's some debate about climate change, but the seas seem to be getting warmer, which is not good for them. Uh, a lot of pollution going into the water, which is definitely not good for corals either. Deforestation actually has an impact on them as well. And when the coral reef system bleaches out or dies, then an entire ecosystem dies. So uh, marine productivity just falls to very low levels. Urged by aquarium staff to get to know your inner shark, the visitor can see, touch, and even swim with a number of different species, from exotic kinds to others readily found in local waters, like the sandbar shark. It's a very important commercial fishery, but it was actually decreased recently because it's just been over-harvested. So, uh, and this is the plight with a lot of the sharks out there. We pose a much bigger threat to sharks than uh, they do to us, and they're an integral part of the marine food web. So people need to forget about jaws and, uh, and start trying to help out that species, all the species of sharks that are out there. Patrick Regan, NJN News, Camden.